Hello, this is Mr. Ahmed and today we'll do lesson 1.4 Mental Math Strategies for Addition And our essential question is What mental math strategies can you use to find sums? Let's unlock the problem The table shows how many musicians are in each section of a symphony orchestra How many musicians play either string or woodwind instruments? Okay, who play? string are 57 and who play woodwind are 15 so we need to add 57 plus 15 okay you may use your old way 57 plus 15 like this 5 plus 7 is 12 i write 2 and 1 up and here 5 plus 1 is 6 plus 1 is 7 so the answer is 72 but here we will use mental math like the following one way count by tens and ones to find 57 plus 15 so we will start always with the bigger number so 57 we will start with the 57 and we need to add 15 here in letter a we will count on the nearest 10 then count by tens and ones so 57 we will count after 57 after 57 58 59 60 so the next 10 is 60 and then we will count by 10 and once but first think 3 plus what equals 15 we added 57 plus 3 to get 60 so we still need how many more to add the 15 we still need 12 more so 3 plus 12 is 15 so in order to add the 12 by counting tens and ones we can add 10 to get 70 and we still need two more so we will have 72 so first we count it after the 57 to the nearest 10 which is 60 so we added 3 then we added 10 so it's now 13 so we need to add 2 more so we will add the whole 15 this is one way or the other way we will count by 10s first then we will count by 1s okay so from the 57 we always start from the bigger number from the 57 we will add 10 so we'll get 67 and after the 67 we will count how much more okay we added 10 so 10 plus 5 is 15 so we need to add 5 more so after 67 68 69 70 71 72 so our answer is 72 so 57 plus 15 is 72 okay the mental math helps you to do the problems fast and easy in your head you can count after the 57 3 so you'll have 60 then you say i'll add 10 more i'll have 70 and I'll still need two more to add the whole 15. I added 3 and 10, so I added 13. Then I need to add two more, so I'll have 72. Or you can say from 57 and I can go directly to 67. It means I added 10 and I need to add five more. You count after 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72. The drawing is to show your steps okay try this find 43 plus 28 draw jumps and label the number line to show your thinking okay so we said we will start from the bigger number which is the 43 so here we'll start with the 43 and we need to add 28 so to add the 28 maybe we add 10 and 10 we add the 20 then we add the 8 like this okay after 10 if i added 10 
we will have 53 10 more we will have 63 so now we add 10 and 10 20 we still have to add 8 more what about plus 8 okay so we'll add 8 more 64 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 we added 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and we got 71 so our answer is 71 so again I added 10 and 10 and 8 it means I added 28 okay other ways you can use compatible numbers like here we can use compatible numbers to add 178 plus 227 first step break apart the add-ons to make them compatible so here our compatible numbers are 175 and 225 these are close to 178 and 227 so the 178 is 175 plus 3 and 227 is 225 plus 2 and in step number 2 we'll find the sums so the 178 is 175 plus 3 and the 227 is 225 plus 2 now we add 3 plus 2 is 5 and 175 plus 225 75 plus 25 is 100 so I write two zeros and I carry up 1 1 plus 2 is 3 plus 1 is 4 so our final answer is 400 plus 5 equals 405 so again I broke apart the 178 into 175 plus 3 and the 227 into 225 plus 2 because 75 plus 25 is 100 and that is easy to add okay another way is using friendly numbers okay friendly numbers are numbers with a zero in ones like the 30 the 40 the 80 the 200 all of these numbers has zero in the ones place okay so here we need to add the 38 plus 56 using friendly numbers first tip number one make a friendly number okay so think add to 38 to make a number with zero ones okay so 38 after 38 39 40 and 40 has zero in ones so we add 2 we will get 40 so 38 plus 2 is 40 think of this as you took this 2 from the 56 so we will subtract 2 from the 56 will be 54 so the new problem will be 40 plus 54 it has the same answer as 38 plus 56 the 38 becomes 40 it means we got 2 from the 56 so I must make the 56 54 now I add 4 plus 0 is 4 and 5 plus 4 is 9 so our answer is 94 again using friendly numbers I have to get 0 at the ones place the 38 needs 2 to be 40 to have 0 in the ones place so I'll take these two from the 56 so I have to subtract 56 minus 2 so I have 54 okay maybe someone say I have another way and instead of making the 38 40 I'll make it 30 by subtracting 8 if I subtract 38 minus 8 I'll have 30 
and 30 has zero at once it's a friendly number okay so if i subtracted eight from a number i have to add it to the other number so 56 plus 8 equals 6 plus 8 is 14 i write 4 and 1 up and the 5 becomes 6 so 64 so now our new problem will be 30 plus 64 so 30 plus 64 equals 4 plus 0 is 4 6 plus 3 is 9 also 94 so this is another way we can make the 38 30 by subtracting 8 and we have to add this 8 to the other number so 40 plus 54 or 30 plus 64 both are correct they both give us 94 now for share and show count by tens and ones to find 63 plus 27 draw jumps and label the number line to show your thinking okay like we said we start from the bigger number which is 63 so we'll start with the 63 and we need to add 27 okay we can add the 20 10 by 10 so 63 after 10 it will be 73 so we added 10 it becomes 73 we can add one more 10 it becomes 83 and we need to add seven more so let's count one two three four five six seven let's see what number will we have after 83 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 so our answer is 90 we added 10 it becomes 73 we added one more 10 it becomes 83 we added 7 it becomes 90 okay number two Use compatible numbers to find 26 plus 53. Okay, think the 26, he made it for us 25 plus 1. And the 53, 50 plus 3. So, if we add it, what will we have? 1 plus 3 is 4. Plus 25 plus 50 is 75. So, what is 75 plus 4? Is 70. 9 4 plus 5 is 9 and I write the 7 here count by 10 and 1's to find the sum use the number line to show your thinking here 34 plus 18 okay I'll start with the bigger number which is 34 so I'll start with 34 we need to add 18 so I'll add 10 then 8 if I add it 10 so plus 10 it will be 44 I have to add 8 more so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay after 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 so our answer is 52 so we added 10 then we added 8 okay the next one 22 49 remember we won't start with the 22 we will start with the bigger one with the 49 so i'll start with 49 and i'll have to add 22 i'll add 10 and 10 and then 2 so after 10 it will be 59 after one more 10 it will be 69 then I'll add two more, so plus two, here 10 and 10, 20, plus two, 22, so after two, let's see, one, two, after 69, 70, 71, so our answer is 71, hope you guys find this lesson easy, 
and if you are in my class i'll check on your own questions with you in the live session have a nice day and goodbye